Here I will show you my husband fixing our fixing the shower cartridge repair <laughs> repair. Well, the idea was to fix the cartridge, <laughs> but this shower is making noises. So just to give a rough idea what happened, one day the shower, water was leaking like this. In a matter of hours, it leaked, just blah, gushing down water. And before the end of the day, I could probably fill up a bathtub in less than 10 minutes. So the water just kept leaking like crazy because the shower cartridge inside is broken. Unfortunately for me, we have a cartridge called Gerber, which is not a very popular brand and very few stores have it. Needless to say, all of our hardware stores do not carry it and have to specially order that sucker from somewhere in the middle of Tennessee. So. Consequently, we had no water for the longest time and we just had to kind of like turn it on for a couple of minutes a day then shut it back down. And the pieces finally came in. Here they are. Replacement shower cartridge. Is there a size? Different yes, sizes? There what, are are, what are... There are many different sizes in uh, for the shower cartridges. If and ever they have the same size with ours, what to get? Well, it's unlikely that they got the same one as us, but it's always important to pull the old one out, look at it, match it online, and see who has it, or just take it to a professional and say, hey, this is a clunker I have, can you match it? If you got a Delta cartridge, good, you're lucky, everybody has those. If you got some Gerber or other no-name brand like us, good luck. <laughs> but there are hardware stores online that will have it, but shipping usually takes about a week. Okay, my husband will show you the step-by-step. -step. Okay, the first couple of steps are going to be fast forwarded because I have already kind of ripped the whole thing out. So, what we'll do now is kind of fast forward that thing. <laughs> what the heck? Well, that was not supposed to happen. Our, it's, um, it's made in China, but um, usually it's more sturdy than that. Well, that's two pieces. <laughs> um, it's all right, guys, relax. I'm a professional. Yeah, I got this. <laughs> and I'm going to take the other screw out. Zoom, 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 zoom. Be serious, there or you Once again, we get two pieces for the price of one. That's okay. So this thing comes off, but there is a silicone usually holding it in place. Originally, it took me about 10 minutes to pop it off. I'm worried I'm going to break the tile, but good lucky. There, more clunkers. Now we have a little shield that's covering up the main cartridge. So I'm gonna take that shield out. This is usually a little piece of plastic, something flimsy, nothing too spectacular. And it should come right off with hands. Next one is a little thingy. Um, that should come right off. And finally, we have a steel casing covering a cartridge. You may need white, uh, pliers or something uh, to get, oh no, it's making sounds, to get this thing off. And this is usually pretty secure here. So once you get this bad boy off, there. Then you have access to the cartridge. And the cartridge is that thing in the middle. The red and blue. Yep. That's the cartridge, that's what controls all the magic. Uh, if you're doing this for the first time, be ready for the water to gush out. Um, uh, our water's already cut off, so I'm okay. I'm gonna try to pull it out. There it is. And this is the faulty one. Doesn't matter how many times I try to bang it. Why it's faulty, my love? There is uh, something on the inside that's this is causing the it to one. leak water. Ah, uh, it's broken. No, I even tried popping it apart and there's still something inside that I cannot figure out that's causing it to fail. Why it's failed? What is know. broken on the plug? Seal, mixer probably. But here there is hole, it's not the same. Nope, there's probably a mixer that's leaking water or for some reason. It's, it's not leaking, but actually there is a hole instead. It should be the same, right? No. On the side there the is hole. The hole's fine. 
No, on the side, it's on the other side is. This is fine. Something inside is the seal is messed up. That's letting the water through. Uh, so that's the new one. And this is the new one. It looks slightly different, but hopefully it's gonna fit. Looks like the mix is brand new. That's good. Hopefully that's what that's supposed to come off. Just taking it apart like a Lego. And now we're gonna have to put it in and pop it in place. Looks like it's off by about one degree to the left. So I'm gonna try to put it in as best as I can. The first thing is to get past the seal. Is there any specific like? You just kind of have to feel it. Like keep turning until it falls in place. Eventually, you won't be able to turn it anymore because um, the two prongs will stick right into the hole and they lock in place. So I think that's where I'm at. I'm trying to turn it to the left, nothing. Turn it to the right, nothing. So it looks like it's pretty tightly in there. And you want to get as tightly as you can, but don't overdo it because that's the purpose of this lovely thing. And this will keep it in place. It locks in and presses it against the apparatus back there. So we're going to screw this in, but that alone would probably not do it. So that's where you're going to use the tools. Make this lovely thing. By script. By script. By script? No, that's not by script. What's um, this? Uh, That's basic. We called it basic. Yeah, definitely. Not long it. nose? No, long nose. I call it woodpecker. No, like we call there is basic, but that one is it's kangaroo style basic. <laughs> so we're gonna adjust the kangaroo style basic, and we're gonna hop around like a kangaroo until we get. Do you need to lock it very tight? Not super tight to the point where you break it, but tight enough where you feel like, okay, I've done a good job. Okay. This is not a lock on a wheel, uh, but it just needs to be fast and secure like in there. Okay. So, bam, that's it. Now we got the wonderful cartridge in there. What I need now, before I go any further, is probably some maintenance. Need a knife. Oh, the knife? Yeah, looks like we need a knife. I'll get the knife first. Thanks, Emma. I'll get the knife. The sm small one or? Sure, baby. Something small. Small. I need to bring the knife. Here you go. Thank you, my love. You're welcome. And now we're going to have to peel this stuff off. That's the old silicone that we no longer need. Do we have silicone? Yes, we do. Why do we have to clean that one? So, we want to clean it so the new silicone can get a nice fresh seal on it and make sure it's nice and watertight because you do not want to have water leaking inside the circle. This needs to be an isolated chamber. If you do get water inside, you could get some serious damage done because then the sheet tack will get wet and you get mold. <laughs> So you, now we're gonna. Are you sure it's like that? Not yeah, this one. Maybe this one first. I think my wife is right. Oops. See, can I? This one. Wait, uh, uh, need the outer metal piece. This one. Yay. So we're gonna put this little so thing. So after that thingy, it's that one. That just kind of sticks on there, nothing too fancy. Oh wait, I almost forgot. I think this is off. There we go. I'm gonna put this back on here, that little semi-plastic flimsy thing. And then she just throw this part more decorated than anything. And now we got two giant screws that are gonna hold this thing in place. So I'm gonna put this on there. Kind of guess where the hole's gonna be, which I don't really know. It's really hard to guess. Just gonna have to just jam it in and hope you hit something. And after you hit something, hope you hit it again. 
are the two screws you, you need to shoot exactly to their hole but the hole could be kind of anywhere -ish. maybe you can see first inside that's the hard and part. then calibrate i know where it's at kind of well i know where the left one is it's, it's a lot easier to see the left one is there along this ledge Part, huh? Very, I'm afraid. There's no shortcut to this. Can I try? Absolutely. I'm a shooter. As you wish, my love. Go for it. All right, so my wife is going to give this a shot. Mm. Oh, shooting, really? Nope, that means you missed. You have to hit something and it's going out. It's not holding out to anything. What do you mean? It can't go in like that. It has to screw in. I can see it. I can see it. Uh -huh. I will shoot it. You got it? Oh, here, use, a, use this thing. Really? If you think you got it, go for it. <laughs> I got it. No kidding. <laughs> wow, leave it to my wife. Great job, my love. Bucks. 200 only? No, more than that usually. Replacement parts, labor, personal favorite. So that, like your calculation. Replace the whole thing? 400 ish. You should see? We saved 400 bucks. How much the cartridge you bought? The cartridge was $30. So, so, but so now you, you believe I'm a shooter? <laughs> wow, okay. Well, how about that? Impressive. Yeah, that took me forever. Good. Doesn't have to be super tight. The same time. Perfect. Perfect. Now then. Yay! <laughs> now I'm gonna get some. Now it's my husband turn. You need to get a little bit of foil. Foil? No, uh, just a little wrap this thing right here. For what? So, honestly, so I don't bury my fingers. Because the next part is going to suck. We have to deal with silicone. And silicone is nasty stuff. So, got this. People usually have a caulking gun and a little scraper and this and that. I discovered that if you use your finger, it's the most effective way, but then it's good luck getting it off. So I figured next best thing, put this thing on. Okay. Excuse me. <laughs> Now we prepare silicone. Da -da -da. May I see the silicone you're using? There is a different types of silicone, right? Yep. But why you you choose that one? Waterproof and white. white. This is probably the best one for the job. Okay. And the, there is another other strong one. This is the strongest silicone. Very, very good. They're all, they all do the trick. As long as it's waterproof, that's the key thing. Waterproof, 100% waterproof. Yep. And then you kind of want to match the color, like in this case, uh, whoever designed it used white, so we're going to go with white. Okay. And now we just have to chop, chop. 
somewhere. I think we can chop chop over here. Yeah, I chop chop. Good. So now that we chop chop, we're gonna. Hmm. I wonder if there is any. I'm gonna put some here on the side to see if I can get some stuff out of there. Weird. Silicon white, yet it comes across as clear. I'm just gonna have to take their word for it. I'm gonna put this on just like so. That's oh, there it is. There it is. Why? That's the wood there, the first, uh, the Got it. green part. That's yeah, just, that was just some um, residue like, on the top. Yeah, residue. And I'm just gonna put a light coat on there. Why light coat? Because eventually I'm gonna smear this thing and you'll collect a lot of extra silicone as you go. Mm -hmm. So this is perfectly fine. As you can see, the mess is because I'm a professional. Good. Well, that was messy. And now comes the fun part. I'm going to smear it using this lovely thing. Smear it using the hands. Using the finger covered using by finger cover. by the plastic wrapper, wrap. sling wrap. Why you need to do that? So I can get get it inside as much as I could ah, in between the cracks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like the space between yep. the wall and the. Thing. Correct. Absolutely correct. Space between the wall and the metal. Bar. And why you have to cover it? That way, no water leaks inside. But this is just the first part, still got messy. Next part is we wanna clean off the excess silicone. And don't be shy to use many, 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 many napkins. You don't wanna flush this, by the way, you wanna throw this out into the garbage. Why? Because silicone tends to stick to stuff. Ah, uh, so you, even you, um, scrape the HC silicone, it's not allowed to use water? It is, but it has to dry, so it has to be 24 hours for it to dry, but for now, we just want to... So we're not allowed to turn on the water bath? We can, we can test it definitely, but we don't want to get any trips it. done. Use it, but we can turn on the water? Yes, yes we can. I'm gonna put a little more on top here. Kind of messed that up. And then I came to realize I'm making a mess. Indeed. Where you will go? More so that's the final work. Because of my handy husband, we save 500 bucks for a plumber. How much we expend the cartridge? The cartridge was only 20, but... We, ex we only ex um, spend uh, 20 bucks for the cartridge. And we wait, when we wait one week? Yeah. We wait seven it. days before they ship it. That's why we, we don't have... Oh, we have water, but we always on and off. On and off. That was sad, but yeah. yeah. It was life. It was interesting. Yeah, part of life. Imagine going to toilet. Water on, water off. <laughs> there are professional tools for this where you can cock it correctly, but this is all I have. It's okay. Important is you fix it, smart husband. Indeed, my dear. This will be done right. My very smart, handy husband. What about Kaikadong? Kaikadong? What about Timo? What about Timo? I'm learning.
You're making a mess. Yeah, this I can see. It's okay, it's not for sale. No, but see, if we wait, silicone's gonna dry up and then good luck getting it off. It's almost like a stain on the shirt. It's best to use the water immediately. Stain on the shirt, because I can wash it in one washing, but I will use some Clorox. Shit, heavy stuff. I like using, I like the smell. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, you know what? The Clorox before we, 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 I use it for like to mix in the water when I will shower. What the fuck? <laughs> what the heck? I'm serious. Like, even even in the province, we, there is a one piece of like the packet of chlorine. We will buy five pieces and then we'll put in the water. My baby, that is. No. Baby, we use we use that one for doing our laundry, especially when we wash white t-shirt. Oh yeah, laundry. Knowing it's 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 hand hand washing, no washing machine thing. That I can understand, but to take a shower in it. Yeah, it to make you white. What the heck? Frightening you enough that actually might work. Not talking about that whole bloody albinizer or anything, but. It's so much, that's enough. Maybe you just remove all the silicone you just put right now. No, it's under. Yeah, but you dig it very deep. Mm, I'm actually avoiding it. Just, Are you sure? Yeah, I'm going just around the edges. And then you will fill it up again. That was my first mistake. Only my third time doing it. So, still a learning. Silicone was never easy for some reason. Doesn't matter how many tricks I use, always make a mess. Both on a product. At and least it's not black, it's white. Yeah, black would have sucked. I don't think that would have matched really well. Yeah, we can just let that here. It's super clean already, we bet it, eh? That's it, eh? Yeah. All right. Mm. Well, in that case. This is the last part. Your chuba ek ek candle. Chuba ek ek. This is the chuba ek ek candle. I'm gonna put this stuff here. Give me that one. Get your chuba ek ek. Okay. Now we got the chuba ek ek handle. Now usually there's like a little tiny screw that you can kind of tweak it in so it holds in place. Somehow this thing just popped off, so oh well. I'll just leave it there. Cosmetically it's fine. Actually, maybe like this. I could turn this way. Now this is low. This is high. Yeah, that looks good. Low, high. Okay. Look. Yeah. Yeah, why it's not down? Because there's a little tiny screw that he had not put in yet. I would need a little tiny screwdriver for that. Um, let me get that little screwdriver. Oh. Oh, what's this? That's the one. Oh, shit. Um, we may need this. <laughs> huh? Yeah, uh, yeah, that's, Im that's important right there. First, I want to make sure this thing stands a little higher. All right there. There. Now, this actually goes inside here. I completely forgot about that lovely screw. I was wondering why it's falling off so quickly. You need screw? Yes, baby. So before the handle, there is a screw to hold that one. Yes, I'll actually get the screwdriver. I because can... that's the rotator, right? To 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 be where it's cold and hot. Mm -hmm. There is one more little thing. I'll get the flex driver for it. What? I will follow you. Sure thing, baby. Because you are the host of this vlog. Da, da, da. You can talk now while you're talking. Okay. Or while you're talking, you're <laughs> getting something. So I'm going to dump this stuff out. And I'm just going to polish this on the way up. But we need a basically a hex driver. So hex driver is a special screwdriver. 
that can fit into this little tiny hole. This is like one of those rare cases where you got to go where, where, where you will get the screwdriver? We are up the stairs. Me in our room? Yep. <laughs> That's far. Come on up, Mrs. Kundra. I'm tired. Right to work. You got it, boy. So I was oh, you just tore them in our room. What the heck? Oh no, privacy has been violated. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, so. so this is our washroom, guys. Since you're already upstairs, it's part of this vlog. Oh, Tutorial in our washroom. Got it. Hex driver. And what do you call that one? Hex driver. I Hex think. driver? Yeah, I think. And hopefully this thing fits in here. Um, does it fit? Yeah, looks like it fits. And this is what we're going to use to seal the deal. So, so the, this is our room. This is my table. Little space. And this is my husband space. <laughs> and this is me. Hi. <laughs> now we're going again. And then we're going downstairs again. Tore you in. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I'm Why you open all the light? I like shiny shiny. Shiny shiny is emong lobot. Lobot lobot. Mhm, emong lobot dako. Break break ni mo eh. Emong borek. I do not know. <laughs> so now I gotta just kind of nail it in there and hope I reach it. Yeah. This is not one of those things we're just gonna kind of hope you hit it. I don't understand. You did not even put a screw. There is a little tiny screw that's already there that cannot be taken out. This little tiny thing. That's a screw. So if you, this goes in there, it can be turned. So what is the purpose you're doing that? Tighten it. If you tighten a screw, you will. It's gonna go, watch this. It's gonna go inwards, up, and it's gonna hold on to this metal piece. Really? Mm hmm. See? Up. Are you sure what you're doing? Yep. I think this is important. Do you know what this went? Oh no. My whole thing is falling apart. I need a screwdriver just to fix a screwdriver, guys. Can you believe the irony in that? <laughs> No, see it. I need a hex driver to fix a hex driver. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I have a screwdriver. Yeah, but it needs, needs a literally needs a hex driver. This is like repeat the business. They want you to buy two of them. I will just get my bulldog on that problem. What the heck? <laughs> so I gotta just tiny bit fix it. So that I guess that was completely unprecedented. It's unnecessary. Not every day, something, a screwdriver breaks. Okay, good. Whoa, that was super tight. You, you can quick now because we are already over time to our video. Okay, so I'm thinking it's gonna go People on. People will get bored of watching this long video and then you're just playing like a... Don't worry. This is like concerto. This is Mozart. This is the purpose of this video no, is to show your step by step, not your forehead, not your... <laughs> I'm just showing them the extreme difficulties one may encounter while fixing a shovel cartridge. Now, this will be good because now it's not going to fall out anymore. Assuming I hit the hole properly. Can I do that? I'm really good on that. Sure, baby. My last turn and that's all yours. Uh, you did hit already? Yeah, I think so. You're, you're just guessing again. Well, a part of me is guessing, 
Yeah, always, you're always busy. But I know I got it right because it's holding pretty tightly. I just need safety. I literally can't feel it. I know. Can I do that? Yeah, yeah, of course. So this is the right one, but it's bent slightly. And we can take care of that because we got a lot of little pliers and this is just a little piece so I can go. Yeah. Ah, okay, that didn't work. All yours. Some wipe stern. Wipe stern. So I gotta get that thing into a little tiny hole. Tiny hole. And you gotta turn it to, the, yeah, just like that. It doesn't need to be super, super tight. Just tight enough. If you can feel the hole, great. If you can't, you missed it. And you know it's working because if you try to pull it out, like of the whole handle, it will no longer pull out. I think that's right. Okay. Handle holds? Yeah. Good. There's a little tiny piece, that little, yeah, that goes inside the hole to cover it up. There, that's it. <sighs> um, put the cap back on and that should be it. I doubt I'll ever reuse it because I'm pretty sure. We can use it, we will just put this cover on and use the slimmer. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Hey, that's a great idea. Does it fit? Good. Handy, handy. Handy, handy. Yeah. Oh, that doesn't have any bags. So you can you can turn on turn them in the main source of the water. All right. So turn we're gonna get some water. So now we're gonna go turn the water on. All right, let's get the water going. And this is it. There we go. And that should be it. Good job, Mr. Kander. We made it. Yay! We made it. We made it. Done, done, done. So that's it for our video, guys. So see you on our next vlog. Please don't forget to like, like subscribe, like, subscribe, and like. Oh, wait, you said like. Oh. Like together. Like, like subscribe, subscribe, and. <laughs> oh, that was okay, see you guys. <laughs>